Charm to see everyone. Welcome to Star Player One. I'm Brand Knight. Today we're getting off a song of memories. We are heading to the spa here eventually. I think the next day. We gotta decide what we're gonna do. We're gonna go home. We're gonna go to the school gate. I'm gonna go home. I'm tired of hanging out of school. I need a break. Okay, Cannon. Just check in one more time. Did you bring your health insurance card? And you're sure you got the time right? Yeah, I have it. And it's the right time. Yeah, everything's good to go. Okay, now all we need to do is... Oh yeah, turn off your phone. And make sure you have your patient's registration card. Brandon, I'll be fine if I just turn it off before I go in the hospital. Alright, my bad. I'm being a good elder brother figure to you. As you can tell. I stopped building my phone and sighed deeply. Janet is having a routine test at the hospital, so she's home from the academy early today. I came home early with her so I could help. But all I managed to do is stress over things not going well, or forgetting something. Well, worrying won't help at all. <laughs> you seem more nervous than me. It's fine, really. I've been doing really well since I came back to Japan. Well, yeah, I could have told you that myself, but I just can't relax. I didn't realize you were the Royan type, Brandon. Okay, I think we better leave now. Roger that. Okay, let's take our time. We don't have to rush. Don't push yourself. Don't do it. I won't let you. Okay, Minato. Sure. Oh, right. You should bring a magazine or something to help you pass the time. I think they might make you wait quite a while. That happens. I'll just get something out of the convenience store. Or talk to my girls in my deed for you app. But I don't tell you that. Okay, let's go. We have everything we need, I think. I double and I triple check, so we're fine. We're fine, but the house is locked, the stove's turned off, let's just go. I take a deep breath, and we walk out the front door. Why do hospitals also always make me so nervous? Especially when I'm waiting for someone. She's really taking forever. She's been with the doctor for an hour now. I hope she isn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's okay. It's no, 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 no. Calm down. She's fine. I'm sure her health has improved. She's eating more and more. She's even exercising a little. Oh, hi, Brandon. Test her over. I suddenly jump in my chair when I suddenly hear Ken's cheerful voice. I think I really should have let Fuka handle this task for me. Forget that noise I just made, Cannon. Yeah, we are stressing way too much over this, I think. What noise? You know, my yeah, sound. Oh. Uh, nothing. So, you didn't hear. Or, you just didn't care. Anyway, let's just ignore it. Sure. <laughs> Ken gives me an ambiguous look, and she daintily sits down next to me. So, how'd it go? Wait, I guess they haven't told you the results yet, huh? 
Well, yeah, but having you here makes me feel a lot less worried. <laughs> Well, I feel ashamed to admit it, but the way I almost died just now was pretty pathetic. Even so, whenever I'm examined, I always get very nervous. I'm scared to find out that I took a turn for the worse. But I felt totally fine today. It's because you were here with me. Yeah, I'm glad we went home. That was the right choice. Kanon. I really am happy you're in my life, Brandon. Okay? I'm glad we're friends, too. Uh, yeah, thanks. I feel my heart get warm and fuzzy. I guess I don't have to do, actually do anything, other than just be present. Colin Kanon Haragi. Ken Haragi. Please report to. Oh, they're calling you. I guess the results are in. Yeah, I know I just told you I'm not scared this time, but I think I'm a little scared after all. Will you come with me, Brandon? If you want, sure. Let's go! To the results! Wow, I was very surprised. You're much healthier than you were when you were hospitalized. Huh? Are you sure, doctor? I almost feel like we're like a married couple. It's like she's pregnant and like we're both freaking out about how great, how healthy she is and all that. <laughs> That's what it feels like in this scenario because like both of them are stressing out about the results coming in. But it turns out it's good news. Yeah, well, she already made a lot of improvement while she was here, but she's made quite the recovery since moving out. I'm not usually the kind of the guy who does fist bumps, but today, I'm that guy. Aw, yeah. I do fist bumps all the time, man. It's fine. Most people don't recover as quickly as you have. You really seem to have the. Uh, you really seem to be responding to the medicine well. Unless it's something else. I'm sure part of it is living with Brandon and his sister. It's how should I put it? It's a cheerleady sensation. Cheerleady sensation? Oh! Well, uh, yes, I get that. That's not entirely unusual. You, under you understood her canonese? Well, I guess I need to study harder. You know the saying, Brandon. Healthy spirit, healthy body? I did not know that. So that meant having the spirit of a cheerleader is what cures illness. <laughs> Why do you think that it's true that her environment is good for her? So thank you. Yeah, thanks. And with that, Kansas exams end with flying colors. And we're on our way home! Lolly. We feel lighthearted, the exact opposite of how we felt when we went into the hospital together. Even our footsteps are a little lighter. Yeah, really uh, Wow. I really am relieved. Now I feel stupid for worrying so much before. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I was amused watching you be so nervous since I don't get to see that from you often. But thanks. I mean it. 
風花も入れて、俺たち三人は家族も同然だろ。Don't mention it. We live together. You, me, and Fuku are family now. Sure thing. しかし、安心したらなんだか腹が減った。朝も食べなかったし。But now that I'm not nervous anymore, I'm suddenly starving. I didn't eat breakfast either. Kaminato, Kincho ste no domo tora na ite kanji da ta yone. Doko ka de tabete iko ka. Yeah, you're the type who doesn't eat when he's nervous, right? Wanna go grab a bite? I'm the same way too. When I'm nervous, I don't really like to eat. So da na. Ada ajo ni demo yotte iko. Kono jikan nara konde nai da roshi. Sure, how about we swing by Agios? It's probably not too crowded by this time of day. Oh, yeah, you mean Kaori's place? Right? Any particular dish that you recommend? Hmm, let's see here. Konnichiwa! Hi, Kaori! Irashimase! Oh, hi. Oh, it's just you and Canon today? Just to be in the canon to eat the Kairin and the seal. Yeah, we're all the way back from the hospital. Kaori san, Konnichiwa. Kono Hidewa, Arigato was I must. Kiki, Tot de Moish got to this. Hi, Kaori. Thanks for the cake. It was delicious. Do it as you must. Takura de Canon chan. Mm-hmm. You're welcome, Missy. So, how's it feel shacking up with this guy, Cannon? Shacking up? Whoa! I can't believe you went there. Seriously, though, it's not like that. She's just like my little sister. That's it. That's all it is. Besides, Fuku is also living with us, so it's not the same as shacking up. <laughs> oh, really? I see, I see. Oops, my mistake. Slip of the tongue. <laughs> She's lying. She's totally lying. She said that on purpose. He wanted to see her reaction. So you're on your way home from a date? We just told you we, could, we went to the hospital. It's not like that. Not again. Date? But it's really not like that, right, Brandon? Can't ask frantically, blushing red. By the way, Cory, could you take us to a table? Stop torturing Cannon and just do your job, lady. <laughs> Oops, sorry about that. Okay, you guys can have this table. I'll be right back to take your order. Ah! Ah! You sit down and order our food and finally get a chance to breathe. I moisten my parched throat with a cup of water and sigh heavily. <sighs> Why did Kaori have to ask me that question out of the blue? That startled me. Ah, uh, my ears are all red. Wow, they are. She really got you bad. I mean, all we did was go to the hospital for my exams. I think it would be more, you know, romantic. Yeah. To be honest, I was more nervous today than I'd be if it, this was a date. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. I've never seen you that frantic before. I came back from the exam room and said hi to you. You made the most ridiculous noise. 
So you did hear it. Yeah, so she did hear that exactly. Before. Forget you heard that. To be honest, I'm just remembering it makes me, just remembering it makes me feel embarrassed. Oh, I doubt I'll be I'll ever be able to forget how you acted today because you were I don't know. You were really cute, okay? I know you think you were being uncool, but you really were a big help to me. Oh no. Cannon, don't fall in love with me. Don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I'm being really cheesy, aren't I? Oh, to be young again. Kerry sighs, suddenly sticking her head out, sticking her head at our table. Can I jerk our heads away from each other? Guys, stop popping out of it. Nowhere. You freak me out. <laughs> Sorry, I was bringing your food when I overheard you were having a very interesting conversation. <laughs> oh, thanks for the food, by the way. It smells really good. Enjoying yourself, guys? Oh, right. Shall I keep your conversation a secret from Fuka? Oh, don't be like that. It's <laughs> been our drink. <laughs> Easy there, Ken. Talking, talking like 60 miles an hour there. I don't think Fuka would really care, and it's not like we were having a deep conversation anyway. Um, you know. <laughs> Okay, I do like Kaori a lot more now, just because she's just teasing it, both of them, and it's really funny to watch. And as Kaori teases us mercilessly like that, can I have our meal? Well, it's a good day, on all. I'm glad scan test results were good. I'm glad I spent the day with her. It was fun. Not in a romantic sense, but you know. Ugh, I messed up royally! Only an idiot would forget his homework at the academy. To be fair, though, it makes sense why we would be we would forget it because we were so worried about Ken's test. Well, the academy sure is creepy at night. Okay, let's just get this over with and go home. Ah! <laughs> 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 What? What's a monster doing here? Why are you just stand there, Brandon? Stop cowering and start fighting. Yeah, I know. Wait a minute. <gasps> Knight, are you okay? Akira-san. Akira-san? Akira, what are you doing here? I'll explain later. First, we need to feed him. Okay, Knight, let's go. Let's do it. Together. As a team. Wait, but this is also sudden. Oh well. Let's just go for it. Arr. Knight, you can't just stand in front of it. Keep your distance and dart from side to side. Uh, hi! Hi! Okay. <laughs> That's her singing. That's Akira's song by herself. I can't translate that, I'm sorry. 
Huh? The monster ran away? We can't let it escape. Seal off its escape. Okay. Hey, where do you think you're going? Let's close in on him. Finish him off. Ready? Oh, D for you and her are working together. They're both singing. To dust. We made it somehow. And I didn't have to do a battle, surprisingly, for that scene. Night, thanks for your assistance. You fought well. Oh no, Akira, you did all that. I expect this level of performance from you next time. I must be on my way. Wait! Ah, she left again. She left again. What is accurate doing in my economy? She at least told me. And she said she expected this level of performance from me next time, but... Is accurate mistaking me for her psychic now? Okay, I was going for more partner, or like, I don't know, lover, but you know, whatever. Whatever, we take what we can get, protagonist. <gasps> it's finally here! October 14, we're at the pool! Hoorah! Wow, I had no idea they built a pool center this big in this town! They built it last year. It's my first time here, too. But to he, well, I already been here once last year. That's nothing to brag about. Let's see, no one's here yet. Good morning, Canon Fuka. Thanks for guiding us here. You can go home now. Brother, it seems like no one else is here yet. True. I certainly can't hear anyone. What? Is that a way to respond? Well, sorry, I was only joking. You really think I'm going to take that sit down? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Makoto. You seem more cheerful than usual today. I wonder why. Yeah, maybe not to be so bold with that claim. Well, of course I am cheerful. Beautiful bikini babes coming soon to a public pool near you. Yep, maybe you should have said that. You stay quiet, unless you want to get us kicked out. Yeah, he's hopeless, right? Seriously. Hmm? Who's that? Oh, it's them. Oh, Ken, the others are already here. Hi! Hi! Hello! Hi, Yuno, Satsuki. Cool, everyone's here. Let's go swim. Well, we're forgetting not to me. And hopefully, I care. Maybe she might show up. Maybe. No, oh, wait a minute. We're still short. Brandon, sorry I'm late. Oh, so you're here. Okay, that's everyone. Are you sure? Okay, now let's... 
Oh, you guys. <gasps> it's Akira-san! She's here too! Huh? Oh, it's you from that day! You're Akira, right? What is Akira doing here? Yes, Akira Tabunaki. Sorry I bought you guys. Sorry I bought you guys the other day. And at the same moment, the protagonist's heart, our heart, is beating a little faster when we see her. We don't know why yet. It's because he likes her. He doesn't know it yet. What brings you here today? Wait, are you conducting surveys at this pool? Huh? Oh no, there's no problem at the pool. If anything, I'm the problem. What do you mean? I've been working at the desk all day lately, so I'm out of shape. I thought I'd go for a swim for some exercise. So, so, this guy! Oh, this is more good, this guy! Mizugi de! Solo party de! Oh, really? You're also here to swim? In a swimsuit? With that body? Okay, our character would tackle Mokoto. No! Stop! Everyone, run! Save yourselves! Yeah, I know. Don't mind him, he's a pervert. <laughs> okay, well, you excuse me. Bye, Akira. Sure, bye. Like our character pictures, like, wait a minute, Akira's gonna be here in a swimsuit? And his heart's, and he's sweating a little bit. His heart's beating quicker. His, he's also starting to sweat too. This is backstory, it's not even canon, but you know. I'm just telling you what my character's feeling. <laughs> wow, so that sexy lady is also at the swim park. Okay, now things really got interesting. I'll go take care of our tickets fast. Sure. Watch him. Thanks. And after we get into the park, let's change quickly and meet up at the poolside. Roger that, Captain. Okay, brother. See you later. Sure. Unchanged daily life. Okay. Change into my swim trunks. <laughs> Makoto, I know you're excited, man, but you need to calm down a little bit. You're, you're gonna creep everyone out. You already are kind of creeping everyone out. This guy. Hey, Makoto. Quiet. Look. I'm... I'm currently having an out-of-body experience, looking down on this world from above. I'm looking down specifically beyond this wall. So in layman's terms, you're fantasizing what the girl's change room looks like. Exactly. My friend, open your eyes and let the mysterious waves of the universe carry you. Then you too shall behold a beautiful world. Sorry, I think I'll pass on that. I'm just changing my swimsuit and, you know, go out there. What? What's that? <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> Do you see it too? Yes! You can see it too, amigo! You can see the beautiful dream world! 
バカな俺が誠の妄想に引きずり込まれるだと You idiot! You're, you su- <laughs> you suggested, you're suggesting Oh wait, you suggested you s u b z a p me Oh, okay I can read it now You idiot! You suggested you z a p me into your sick fantasy But now he's mentioned it, I can totally picture the girls giggling and changing on the other side of the wall What's wrong with me? <laughs> Yikes, Cannon. You really developed since the last time I saw you. <laughs> oh, I don't think so. I haven't grown at all, but you. Look at you, Yuno. I'm impressed. <laughs> We're stuck in the fantasy world, people! <laughs> We are a teenage boy, I guess, though. Probably your mother's genes. Or maybe the muscles you developed in gymnastics helped enhance them. But still, I wish I had your body. I kind of just want to see Akira personally. Ah, Cannon, where do you think you're looking? I see thirst in your eyes, girl. You almost look like those boys who swarm, who swarm to a gymnastics practice. Wait a minute, I didn't mean it like that. All perverts shall pay. Even you are not exempt from this, Cannon. But Sasuke, I really didn't mean it that way. All perverts shall be exercised. Oh, come on, it's just a joke, a little joke. Calm down, Sasuke. Hmm. I know, I was also joking. Huh? Oh, right, that freaked me out. Freaked me out too. Sasuke, you don't usually joke. Well, today is. special. Man, is how long. where's this fantasy taking us? Well, it's not even a fantasy, I, well, it is. It's in our heads. I think. Huh? What's wrong, Fuka? You look perplexed. Huh? Perplexed? Nope, nothing's wrong. Nope. Why are you so flustered? No reason. I'm not flustered. <laughs> that laugh, though. Fuka. What is it, Satsuki? Don't worry. You're developing good time. What? No, 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 no! Snap out of it! That's my sister! Stop it! Stop it! Stop fantasizing! Stopping me! Hey, Makoto! Oh no. He's still trapped in this dirty fantasy. Snap out of it! Let's get dressed and get out of here. Everyone's waiting for us. Hmm. Alright, that's what we're here for. The, be the beautiful bikini babes are waiting for us. Don't strip off with such gusto. And gusto. And stop shaking like that. Oh, there they are. Hi, brother. And we will have to end it there. I let this episode go a little longer than usual. Just because I told you guys in the last episode we will get some fan service. And we got some fan service now. Now we're at the day with the water park. Hopefully, we can see more of the girls, I guess, and more Acura. And. I don't know, seems like the monster battles are escalating, so I feel like things are going to get dark here pretty soon. 
So if you guys would, try to snap yourself out of that sick fantasy by pressing that subscribe button right down below. Leave a like comment if you guys would as well. And as always, I'll see all of you in the next Star Player 1 episode. Bye! <laughs>